freaks of nature? Well, then come on down to Captain Spaulding's Museum of Monsters and Mad Men. <laughs> yeah, see the alligator boy. Ride my famous murder ride. Most of all, don't forget to take home some of my tasty fried chicken. Ha <laughs> ha! It just tastes so damn good. Want to know about the biggest metal bands in the industry? Want to know about those legend tier bands you just can't do without? You need to go to deathbymetalstl.com right now to keep up to date on all your favorite bands, interviews, backstage stories, and lots more. Go there right now. See what all the buzz is about. Deathbymetalstl.com. Looking for a good time? Looking for a show? You're not quite sure where to go? Man, let me tell you a great place that I've been going to for years. That is probably one of the top places in St. Louis for underground shows, no matter what genre of music you're into. And that's Fubar St. Louis. Located at 3108 Locust Street, St. Louis, Missouri, 63103. You want to talk about a great place with awesome bands and awesome people. And you're going to get to meet those people and have a very personal experience. And you're going to be in the crowd losing your mind. It is one of the best places in St. Louis to see an underground show still to this day. So get on down to FUBA. Again, that's located at 3108 Locust Street, St. Louis, Missouri, 63103. Whether it's EDM, metal, punk rock, indie, acoustic, doesn't matter. Again, one of the best venues in the St. Louis area. Go check them out right now at www.fubarstl.com. They have a calendar, lots of dates, tons of shows, and you can electronically buy your tickets online ahead of time on VIP list. So, go again right now and check out fubarstl.com. Also, give them a like on Facebook and check them out on Twitter. Thanks for tuning in. Keep listening. Right now, you're listening to Zeitgeist Records Radio Network. You're listening to Pit Midwest Metal Radio. Make sure to catch our shows every Wednesday from 1 o'clock till 5 p.m. and every Monday night from 5 p.m. till 10 p.m. for Monday Night Metal. Tune in every week on our Facebook page for our live links and live broadcasts at www.facebook.com front slash the pit Midwest Metal Radio. Thanks for listening and stay metal, guys. Hey, guys, we are back. And, man, you know, I still got some extra time tonight. I don't normally do it, but, uh, you know, I think I'm going to play a, I'm going to go a little over time tonight because, uh, you know, I... I really want this to be a good show and a solid show. I really want to do it right. And, you know, this is a tribute show to Perry Richardson. Um, he passed away a couple of days. He's, he was a brother of mine in the metal community for a long time. And he busted his ass for a very long time. And, uh, you know, it was it's really sad and tragic that he's left us so young. And, uh, you know, we want to give a shout out to his family and tell them how much we're really sorry and, and give them our condolences and his friends and, and former bandmates. Um, we are so sorry. We can't even express words to you to, to tell you how sorry we are. Uh, we really hope you guys are holding it together. And if there's anything you need from us, just let us know on our end. Uh, we've all kept in communication with some friends and family. So, uh, if they're listening or will listen, let us, let us know if you need anything. We, we definitely want to support you in your time of grieving. And if there's any way we can do that, please let us know. So I decided, um, I wasn't sure if I was going to do something today because this is for Perry. Uh, there was an old band he used to be in a long time ago called Shattermask. Uh, some of you guys might even remember the band. Uh, a lot of us from the locals who've been here for a while, we know who they are. Um, there was a lot of controversy whether or not I should play some of the music for them today. And you know what? I, I don't really give a shit who it pisses off. I don't give a shit what people think. Perry played bass for Shatter Mask forever. That was his that was his baby. He loved that band. He loved everything about the music that he played. And tonight, to end the show out, 
we're going to play a song by Shattermask. And now it's old, so it's not the best of quality, but it's still pretty good for what it is. And I mean, yes, it, it is. It's about seven or eight, maybe nine years old for a song, but it was a good song. And when I was back in the day playing out shows all the time, this was all over the place here in, in the Midwest and in St. Louis, and it was a big deal. Um, so we're, he played bass for that band. So what we're going to do is we're going to end out the show tonight with Divine God by Shatter Mask. Uh, and I know that I might take some flack for that, but personally, Perry was my friend, and I, I wish we could have been closer. I wish I could have spent more time with him. Um, I just think that Perry was a really good guy, and he always showed me respect, and he always showed me kindness, and he was always interested in what I was doing, and he reached out to me a lot, and I really thought highly of him. I did. Even after all the controversy with uh, former bands that he was in, I still always felt very highly of him and felt that he was a great man. So I'm going to get back into the music. So we got some extra time tonight. So we're probably going to play probably an hour over time, maybe a little less. So we're going to dive right back into another playlist. And when we come back, (coughs) (coughs) oh, excuse me, when we come back, from our playlist, we're going to go ahead and close out the show after this next playlist. Um, so we'll go over probably a little, probably like a half an hour, maybe a little bit longer. It depends if we want to throw something extra in there or not. Um, but I wanted to give a little bit more extra time to people who might be tuning in a little later uh, that didn't know that we were going to do this. Actually, This was actually kind of a last-minute decision that I made uh, here at the network because I wanted to do something special to remember Perry by. Um, and because I didn't really have uh, much time on my schedule to get with his family and give them my condolences personally, I wanted to do something that I thought would at least be just as, as sincere uh, and just saying goodbye for Perry. So let's go ahead and dive back into this music. Coming up, we got... Let's see. We got Before I Turn coming up, Some Deceptionist, A Night in Texas, Entombed in the Abyss, The Machinist, Storm the Sky, Kingdom of Giants... The Illumination, The Obsolete, and then we'll be back with a word from our sponsor. As a matter of fact, we'll probably play a few more tunes after that, and when we come back, we'll talk some more about what's going on in the upcoming events. Anyway, you're listening to The Pit. 